Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Crystal and thank you so much for joining us today. And today we're going to be doing like a random shopping haul. I don't know. I've recently picked up like some very like random like <clears throat> little bits and obviously by themselves are not enough to really do like a video about, but I figured why not just go ahead and just throw them all in one video together and get it done. And so that's what we're going to do. So it's a little random haul, but I just wanted to show you guys what I got because it's also cute. And yeah, I just want to share it with you guys. All right. So starting off, everything I have on is new. So first thing is this little, it's like a little tank. It's like ribbed but it's very stretchy and I got this at Shields and it is actually like I think it might be the Shields brand I'm not sure I don't remember I'll have to look when I take it off but it's just this little $16 tank by the way I will try to link everything down below if I can if not I'm so sorry but I should be able to link everything down below so just check in the description box if there's anything you're looking for at the end of this video anyways this is super comfy and it comes in a ton of different colors. It also comes in um, another style where it has like a V if you wanted to show a little bit more cleavage. But I like how stretchy it is. I like the length. It goes perfectly with a pair of jeans. So you cannot go wrong with it. And I know all the ones made like this are 16 bucks each, which is not a bad price at all for a really good basic like under, like a undershirt something that you would wear under things, but it would also look really cute with just this and a pair of jeans on a hot summer day. So that would be cute as well. So moving on, next thing I got, I also got these at Shields. Like guys, they recently opened up a Shields here in Colorado Springs and I was just like, okay, what is it, you know? And my husband and I went in there and okay, so needless to say, I don't think I need to go back in anymore because they have a huge selection of women's clothes and they are all so trendy. They're on trend. They're on, they're like in style. They have amazing brands. They have like Levi's, they have free people, they have dirty cotton. They have so many different really amazing brands. Like I can't even remember all of them to be honest but yeah so anyways I got a lot of this stuff at Shields but it's like different brands so anyways anyways I'm getting caught off guard not caught off guard off on a tangent I can't talk just ignore me y'all are used to it by now if you've been here for a while but anyways I got these jeans these are a brand called hold on let me grab this tag Verve Blue if you see that and their website is vervedenim.com so I'll link their website down below as well and honestly guys these jeans are amazing they had so many different styles and washes as well but this one really just spoke to me and I spent 50 bucks on these jeans so that's a really good price for jeans to be honest you're gonna spend around that on a pair of like American Eagle jeans so this is like a really nice sturdy denim, but also like it's soft. Obviously there's some distressing in the knees and at the very bottom, it's got like a frayed like edge at the very bottom, which is so in right now. So many pairs of uh, denim like have that at the bottom. It comes directly at my ankle, which is the perfect length. I love these jeans. They are so comfortable. I'll show you the booty in case you're interested. Here they are. And guys, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to have to pick myself up another pair of these like jeans, like in a different style because these are so comfortable. I got a size 27, which is my usual size in jeans. And these fit exactly like I would expect them to fit, which is awesome. I hate it when I get my normal size in a pair of jeans and it's like, okay, why does your 27 fit like a 20, like a 25? You know what I mean? I, we've all had it happen. So I really, really love these jeans. So cute. So glad I grabbed them. And then next up is this little, what do you call these? Kimonos? Is that what you would call these? 
kimonos. It comes below the knee about mid calf. Obviously, it's got this beautiful floral print. It's got blues and teals and pinks and like it's this nice cream color. I thought it was really pretty, really spring and summer. And I loved it. This was $40. And honestly, I don't feel like that's expensive for the quality that it is. It has this beautiful like detail right here. And this is the brand Angie. And this is a brand that I remember getting so often in boutiques in the South. And as soon as I saw it, I was like, oh my gosh, like I have to have it. I used to have so many pieces made by this brand because in the south apparently it was popular I don't know a lot of boutiques that I my mom and I used to shop at carried this brand and I just love it so I was so happy to snag this and I really do like this um, kimono I feel like they're so easy it's an easy way to bring together an outfit that you may like you know have like a plain outfit and you throw on this and then suddenly it's not as plain anymore so maybe you've been running errands all day and you have on like a white tank and some jeans and you need to go to dinner and you don't have a lot of time throw on a kimono looks like you tried a whole lot harder than you actually did so that is these three pieces we're going to try on some more stuff and i'll be right back okay guys so more shields finds okay don't judge me listen I went in there twice and both times my husband was like, just go look, just go get some stuff. And I'm like, okay. All right. So first thing we're going to talk about is this jacket. Oh my gosh. All right. So I know unless you live under a rock, you've probably seen these quilted jackets everywhere. You can see them at Target. Um, they, I saw Wild Fable had one and Universal Threads had their own and they're at Free People and Urban Outfitters and so many different places you can get these um, like waffle knit jackets, quilted jackets. Is that what it's called? Quilted jackets. That's what it is. Is it? I don't know. You know what I'm talking about. Like ignore the dog hair on this because I've been wearing this, but you see what I'm talking about? How it's got like the little square patch. Y you get what I'm saying. You know. Anyways, <laughs> I saw this one. Actually, my husband spotted it at first, and it was um, a lighter green camo print one, and he was like, oh, that's cute. I was like, yeah, it, it really is, and then I saw this one, and I was just like drawn to it. It is so comfortable. I have worn this thing almost every day since I got it. It's like when I get chilly, I just throw this on with whatever I have on. I wear it to take my daughter to school. I wear it to run to the mailbox. Like it's just so comfortable. And now I see why everybody has one and everybody's always in it because it is so cozy and so comfortable and I love it. This is the brand Z Supply. This was originally, I think, $98 and I got it on sale for $75 and like I said if I can link it I will but if not maybe I'll try to find some more jackets made like this that I can link down below if you're really interested in getting one so you can find one okay so we're gonna take the jacket off as comfy and cozy as it is we're gonna take that off we're gonna put it to the side okay so next up is this tee also got it at Shields um, it is so comfy I got it in a size medium just because I didn't want it to be like, I didn't want it to be tight. I wanted it to be a little oversized. Uh, what does this say? Bad company. Okay. So it's a bad company. They had Grateful Dead and like other ones. So I was just trying to figure out what exactly the one I grabbed said. I love how, I love how torn up it looks, to be honest. I love distressing. I love just like old ratty looking clothes. I think they look comfy and cozy and they just look really cool to be completely honest. So I love this tee. It is a little bit longer but it does have like cool holes all throughout because I know a lot of times when you get graphic tees like this that are distressed it might have like a hole in the front of the sleeve and like up here but then on the back it's like we we didn't have time to distress that part. And it's like come on now like the whole shirt needs to look distressed. So I really do like this shirt. It's so comfy. It was $38. It is the brand Dirty Cotton Scoundrels. And obviously I will try to link their website if they have their own specific website down below. I may have to peek, P 
peek on it if they do and uh, grab some more teas to be completely honest because this thing is so comfortable and so cute. All right, so this was $38, pricey for a t-shirt. I'm not even gonna lie. I really did not wanna pay that for, for it to be 100% honest, but my husband was like, no, just get it. Just get it, if you want it, get it. So I was like, okay. Um, anyways, moving on to these denim shorts. Okay, so these are Levi's, they're the 501s. These are a high rise, um, just distressed denim shorts. I normally get a 27, but I got a 20, yeah, I normally get a 27, but I got a 28 in these just because I didn't want them to be too tight. I wanted them to be a little bit looser and more comfy. And these are certainly comfy, but they are a little big. Let me back up a little big in the waist. So I wasn't really counting on them being that big in the waist, but they are super comfortable. So that is nice. And they don't fall down just because they fit more here. So they're not going to like fall down on me or anything. So that's nice. These are really comfortable. These are button fly, which you can't really tell that they're button fly. So that's cool because I know some people just don't like how that looks. So this is really concealed right here. So you can't tell that it's a button fly short. I don't really mind. I think both are cute, but I didn't even know these were button fly until I got them home. I thought they had a zipper. Put it that way. But I really like these. His, this is what the booty looks like. There's distressing, but not too much, in my opinion. I think it's just enough to make them just look comfy and cool. I think maybe the only thing I would change is like a little bit darker wash, possibly. But there's nothing wrong with the lighter wash, nothing at all. I know it's all just preference. If I could have gotten them in a darker wash. I would have gotten them a little bit darker, but I liked this style, so I stuck with these, and I'm really happy I did. They are super comfortable. I want to say these were 50 bucks, if I can find the tag. Yes, $49.50, so a little under $50, 50 cents short of 50 bucks. Not bad at all. But again, super cute denim shorts, super comfy. And I really don't think you could ever go wrong with Levi's. Just, I mean, like, they're really durable. I have Levi jeans in there that, like, are vintage. And they've been kicking around for so long. And they still, like, look and feel brand new. And they're still just as, like, well-made as they were a long time ago. So, anyways, two more pieces. And then we will be able to wrap up this video, guys. Okay guys, so here is the next piece. Same Levi shorts, we're talking about the top. It is from Free People. And honestly, I don't normally buy a ton of stuff from Free People just because like they can be so expensive. But I just saw this top and I just thought it was way too cute to pass up. So I had to get it. I've really been into this blue color lately. I don't know, I just think it looks really, really pretty with blonde hair, I guess. I don't know. I've never really been into wearing blue too often, but like recently it's like, oh, everything blue just really catches my attention. But I love this top. It is so cute. I love the sleeves. They're not uncomfortable. They're not too tight. I just think they're so girly and so pretty. This top will look so cute with some really cute jeans and a pair of booties and you're out the door, easy peasy. Like, I'm just so glad I picked this up. I kind of like was on the fence about it, but it is so cute and it's not super fitted. So you don't have to worry about it. Like, you know, being like this, it is just adorable. I got this in a size small, which is the perfect size. And this was around 40 to 50 bucks, somewhere in there, which is pricey for a top. But you know, every once in a while, it's okay to splurge on yourself if you can. So I did. And I'm really glad I did. I really love this top. So cute. So we're going to throw on the last piece and then we'll be done. Okay, last but not least, we have another free people top. This is another distress top. You know, as you can see, there's like holes and distressing and like all that stuff, which I've already stated in this video that I really like that. So I know it's not for everyone. Some people are like, why would I buy a shirt with holes in it? But, you know, you do you, I'll do me, we'll all be happy. Um, but I really liked this top. 
I thought it was just too cute, too comfy, and just, it was just too me to pass up, to be honest. So I grabbed this one as well. It's got a little pocket, so little pocket tee. It just looks like a really basic tee, but obviously it's distressed. It comes a little lower in the back than it does in the front. It's not super long, but it's not super short either. Like, you know, it's gonna cover up the booty almost and all that. So it's not like a crop top. I liked that. It's super comfy and cozy. This thing is so soft. Like, it's so comfortable. I have a feeling I might live in this shirt. Um, you just know when you get those pieces where you're just like, yep, I'm gonna wear this constantly. And I feel like this is gonna be one of them that I just want to put on every time I'm running out the door or lounging around the house. So don't be surprised if you see it a lot more. All right, this concludes this random shopping haul, just random brands, random stuff. Anyways, I just wanted to share with you guys, try it on, chit chat, you know, show you what I got. And yeah, so that concludes this video. Please do not forget to subscribe before you go. Just go ahead and click that subscribe button for me and I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you to all the new subscribers that we have. Thank you so much for joining the fam and I hope you stick around and I hope you enjoy your time here as well. Any suggestions for anything that you wanna see, leave them in the comments down below. I don't care what it is. I'm totally open for suggestions, what you guys wanna see, whatever it may be, just leave it down there and I will check it out. I want to say thank you so much to those that like to like chit chat in the comments and all that stuff. You guys are awesome. Y'all are also kind and sweet and I just love you guys so much. And yeah, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it so I know you enjoyed it. And ring that bell before you go so you're notified next time I upload a video and you won't miss any new content. I love you guys and I will see you in my next video.